Now, Six News Sports. There are many different ways to enjoy Christmas, and one of them is in a basketball game, or even better, winning a basketball game. Jays at home against DePaul playing on December 25th for only the second time, and the first was back in the 50s. Creighton also the first team in the conference to host a game on this day. Trey Alexander has himself a ball game. Trey knocks down four threes in the first half alone, several of them over there on the left wing, right in front of the DePaul bench, and there was definitely some chirping over there. He also hits the boards. When Ryan Kalkbrenner fires threes, it takes one of the Jays' best rebounders out of the mix, but Trey right in there puts it back in. Ryan Nemhard playing a very balanced game, eight points in the first half and eight more in the second. He shoots 50% from the field. Trey scores 14 in the first half and 18 more in the second for a career high 32, including another career high with seven three pointers. Creighton starts the second half of double digits and that does not change in the final 20 as Arthur Kaluma hits a jumper. Nemhard great from the arc. He connects on three of four. Creighton a winner 80 to 65 behind a Christmas to remember from Trey Alexander. After what was it, the third or the fourth three in the first half, I was like, my shot's feeling really good. So, I mean, R2 and my teammates were getting it to me in the right spots, and I was just letting it go. So, they believed in me, and I appreciate every single one of my teammates. I couldn't do it without them. So, super happy for him. Um, I see him work every day. Uh, I, know, I know what he does. We work a lot together, and uh, it's super happy for him to, to pay off and, and have a day like today. So, uh, more to come in the new year. He's been stuck in a little bit of a shooting slump, I think, by his standards. Uh, <clears throat> but, in, you know, in terms of his three-point percentage, it's, it's up across the board from a year ago. Uh, so he just, you know, he's, he's picked and chose his attempts uh, pretty wisely. Uh, and as he said today, he had some opportunities where guys made the extra pass to him, and, and he made him pay. So, uh, you know, Trey, Trey works hard on his game, as, as Ryan said earlier. Um, he's in the gym a lot. I see him down there almost every morning. And, you know, that hard work pays off. With the win, the Jays have now won 17 straight against DePaul, and that is the second longest streak in program history. The, uh, the streak started in 2015, ties with South Dakota, also 17 in a row. That, though, from 1918 to 1936, and only uh, 18 in a row against Grinnell is longer. So I'll have a chance to uh, match that next time they play DePaul. Let's